think love and think drugs and they're the same thing inside and we struggle or get enough but it's the same thing burn holes in the most <laughs> In the outros, in the fade outs, and in the background noise. We do wish it on my rivals. I got no enemies. We all fall for the decoy. Sometimes it slides by by. Don't lie to yourself. Almost ain't good enough. Ain't no extra lives. Leave them alone. How we living? Very on road. And it's so, so driven. And the food's ain't cold. Y'all keep chilling. We'll be tracks you following. Whoa. Let's give you the TTP. Candy, can I ask you something? Sure, kid. Play it on me. Do tigers crawl? I don't know, Monty. I never thought about it. But I don't think they do. Why do you ask? Well, I drew a picture last week at school, and the teacher wanted to know why I put tears on my tiger. I told her he was very sad, like you get sometimes. You have something else, little man. If you want to put tears on your tiger, or drag is in your jungle, you tell your teacher that your big brother said it was fine. Who are you? <laughs> Gerald, this is your little sister. Angel! <laughs> and Queen! And Queen! And Queen! How can you say you want to go to college? What kind of college is going to take you with grades like this? I never said I wanted to go to college. You were the one who said I wanted to go to college. What do you mean? We've well, been talking about college since you were a little boy. Getting a degree. Maybe in the field of business administration. That's your dream, Dad. Not mine. Well, what about basketball? Didn't you want to go to college to play ball so you get a chance at professional basketball? You've really improved your game this year. How would you know? You never come to even one of my games this year. Not one! Well, you know how hectic my schedule is. Besides, I've seen you in the yard when you shoot hoops with your friends. I know you're good. Yeah, right. But back to the subject at hand. This absolutely reprehensible report card. Why you gotta always use such big words? I know my report card stinks. Why can't you just say that? If you had a better vocabulary, perhaps you wouldn't be failing English. Why don't you just get off my case? I'm not going to argue with you, Andrew, but I beg to see some major improvements in these last couple months of school, or else you take some severe, punitive measures. There you go with them big words again. What else can you do to punish me? Take away my car? It's in pieces at Joe's auto graveyard. Take away my driver's license? Sorry, the cops beat you to that. Stop me from seeing my best friend? He's in pieces at Spring Grove People Graveyard. I took care of that myself. I killed him, remember? So you can't hurt me. I deal with big time hurt every day. Andrew, I know that accident was very traumatic for you, but you have to get beyond it and move on. You have to be strong and show that you are bigger than the problem. Yeah, I know. You've told me that before. Be a man. Be strong. Put this unfortunate incident behind you. Well, maybe I can't do that. Get away from her. Angel! Angel! Rita, if you get to practice on time, you wouldn't get lost and get yourself all bruised and falling into the bushes. I hope you choke on your own spit! You come back here!
Hello? May I speak to Keisha, please? Speaking. This is Jonathan Hathaway. I hope I'm not disturbing you. No, I was just reading and enjoying this snowy day. Well, that's why I called, sort of. I'm taking some students skiing this afternoon, mostly seniors and a couple of kids in the cross-country team. Just a couple of hours up at Perfect North Slopes. Would you like to go? Sure, why not? Sounds like fun. I'll pick you up in an hour if that's okay. Thank you. For what? For making me get out of bed. For talking to me like I'm a person, not a kid. For bringing me to this beautiful place. I know we tease you that night at the library, but there really is a big difference between you and the high school boys I've known since kindergarten. I've never had a conversation like we just had. It was refreshing, just like this wind. You're so mature, Keisha. Maybe that's why the boys your age don't appeal to you. One of them did, but he's gone. I've heard all about Andy. I'm really sorry, Keisha. Can we make the lift back down, Jonathan? I think I'd rather just talk a little more than try to prove to you I'm bad enough to try deception. Besides, I'm cold. I was just going to suggest that. Let's find the others and head back home. Monty's probably an ice table by now. Keisha, I really enjoyed today. Would you like to go to the movies sometime? If you think it's not appropriate, just let me know. I think I'd like that. Dance contest. Swing dance. Let's win this thing, Keisha. Ask Angel instead. She's probably the best dancer in the room, including you. I hear you're the best dancer in the room. I like to dance, but I don't know how good I am. You want to be my partner for the swing dance contest? What about Keisha? No, kid. This one's for you. Well, hello, Mr. Hathaway. Well, good evening, Keisha. You look magnificent, my dear. That silver really becomes you. Don't you think so, Jonathan? Oh, of course. I'm gonna watch the dance contest. The little freshman angel is quite a dancer. Wow, look at that. You look beautiful. Thank you. I especially like the butterfly necklace. It's just perfect. Are we still going to eat out tonight? Oh, yes. I'll follow you home, and as soon as I see your date leave, I'll whisk you off to a place where dreams come true. Do we have time for that dance you promised me?